We have a bunch of, I think this is one of the reasons that... Uh, his name is up there next to McCain and Huckabee, but campaigners say his voice isn't being heard. Congressman Ron Paul set out to correct that yesterday at a rally at the University of Texas. News 8 Austin's Heidi Joe explains why the candidate continues the race despite the odds. It was at an Austin rally like this one that Ron Paul's dream for the 2008 presidency first took shape a year ago. That is when it sort of dawned on me that you know, this could be something different. A growing number of supporters are trying to make that could into a definite will. About 4,000 cheered on the Texas congressman at Saturday's rally. What brought me out here today was to come see a, a great man, a statesman, uh, the only honest man in the presidential race. I want to honor Ron Paul. I think he's probably the most courageous man in this country, maybe even in this world. Courage in the face of some daunting statistics. Estimates of Paul's current delegate count range from only 14 to 42. More than 1,000 are needed to win the Republican nomination. As long as there's enthusiasm and the number of volunteers keeps growing, and as long as the volunteers and the donors keep sending in money, urging the campaign to continue, uh, will continue to do it. Paul says his campaign still has six million dollars to spend. And as for the enthusiasm... I wheeled all the way from the corner, my wheelchair from the gas station all the way to here. That was no easy task. I want my kids to see that there, uh, there is a remnant in America that still believes in the ideas of the founding fathers, the ideas of liberty and limited government. Paul says that kind of support is what keeps him in the race. Heidi Joe, News 8 Austin. Paul says he's realistic about his odds of winning the nomination, but he's still hopeful. He's measuring his success by his growing number of grassroots supporters and with personal satisfaction that he's furthering his fight for greater personal liberties.